Okay, so we have such a hard decision ahead of us. Jamaica. If you look at the construction versus that construction, I mean, clearly, this is uh, the winner. Because look at all of the detailed piping. I mean, she outlined the various different uniforms, and she gave them names. It just concerns me that it's a schoolgirl outfit for Alizé. Maybe it could be confusing to some consumers. If you look at Bria's as well, that also has a more academic and youthful mm -hmm. connotation. When you compare the style, I think Bria's is a little more fashion forward, a little more current, trendy. Mm -hmm. That's a much simpler construction versus this. There's a lot of intri intricate detail that's required to produce this overall look. Granted, it's a great look, but that's also something that needs to be thought about from a practical perspective. And I also think that it has a better representation of the brand. But there's no accounting for taste because you don't know. Taste is always subjective, but I think we know which design we prefer the most. Thank you, contestants, for your presentations here today. I honestly have no idea who's going to win this thing. You two are competing to win the title of Alize Style Maven, a $10,000 cash prize, and a career polishing pack with opportunities to interact directly with today's top fashion luminaries. We we'll always think I won, but I, I think that Jamaica's was executed like unbelievably, ridiculously well. Are you ready to hear the results? Yes. Are you ready, Aaron? Yeah. Are you ready, David? I'm ready. All right, this is it. The moment we've all been waiting for. Jamaica. Throughout this competition, we feel that you have shown creativity and originality. Your design today was really well executed, but perhaps just a bit too youthful for Alize. And Bria, throughout this competition, you have shown cutting edge style and lots of personality. Your design today was timeless, but lacked technical construction. Bria and Jamaica, can you please both come forward? So who is Alize's winner? The designer who has vision and technical abilities, or the stylist who has her finger on the pulse? Tell us! <laughs> Congratulations, Bria. You are Alize Style Maven. So once I get my hands on that real check, I'm definitely gonna cash it and really work on, you know, the things that I said before, the priorities, which is moving back to the city and starting my collection. But Rhea, wait, there's more. We've also pulled together a career polishing pack with today's top fashion luminaries. You will have the opportunity to do a meet and greet with the industry insiders to help jumpstart the fashion career of your dreams. Career polishing pack participants include James LaForce, fashion publicist and co-founder of LaForce & Stevens. Sydney Bolden, fashion editor. Tracy Reese, fashion designer. Tom Hanley, marketing and public relations professor, Parsons, the new school for design. I have some plans of my own and I just hope that Alizé would want to be a part of it. So Bria, let's celebrate your win. And Jamaica, let's celebrate all of your hard work because you have done a fabulous job. You, you're fabulous in your own right. We are probably going to form some sort of partnership stuff. Because Bria and I are going to be in this for the long haul. So the drink that we're going to have today is a little drink that I like to call Red Carpet and Rock Stars because you ladies are both red carpet ready and rock stars in your own right. It's a delicious blend of Alizé Red Passion and Champagne. Let's toast. All right. Well, everyone, cheers, cheers. to Concrete and Cashmere. And to Bria. Bria, you're Alice in Style Maven. Congratulations, Bria. You are Alize's Style Maven. <laughs> and that would be me, bitches.